Today we are going to talk about the new AI adaptive presets on ON1 Photo Raw 2023 on the beta version I received yesterday. Hi everyone, my name is Eddie, welcome to my channel ON1 Photo Raw Creative Photography and today we are going to talk about the new AI adaptive presets. You will find the AI adaptive presets just there and you will find all the categories. In this purpose of this tutorial, we are going to select the landscape just there and you will find all the AI adaptive presets from the landscape just there. You can have some preview just there as you can see. Just there we are going to select the punch. It's a great preset. You can play with a punch slider just here to select the amount you want of the preset of course. And as you may see, you can find all filters of the presets in the effects tab just there. At the difference, now you have the mask. The mask AI, of course, from ON1 Photo Raw 2023. And for this purpose of this preset, just look at that. We have the landscape and we have the sky, darkened sky just there. We are going to close the vignette, who is a part of this preset. And inside the landscape, you have a mask. You can view the mask just there and as you can see you can play with the opacity of the preset just here on this part of the mask. You can find here just there in the mask AI the category just here the natural ground of the mountain was who selected the mask just there. If you want to add something else in the picture you can do it or if you want to remove everything you can do it too. It's not the purpose today. I'm going to go to this area too in the darkened sky. It's the same thing. You can play with the opacity. You have a mask just there but it's a mask from the sky just here and you can see in the mask AI the selection just here. So it's really interesting because if I select another picture and I select the punch again you will find in the FX tab Again, this preset, but as you may see, we have a landscape just there. If I go to the mask, just here, you see that this preset selects automatically this part of this picture. And for the sky, look at that, it's the same as you may see. This preset select the sky thanks to the mask AI of course. And as you can see you have a before after just there and it's the same with the sky. And if you want to play again with the sky with the exposure etc you can do it all the same. You can play with compression for example. As you may see you can decrease the highlight if you want. You can decrease the clarity a bit like this and as you may see you can do everything you want on this preset. If you want to add another filter you want to select for example a curve just there and if you want to put a curve just here and here you click on apply going to paint in of course to select the right mask and if you want to select the curve just there in the mid turn to increase a bit the exposure in the mid turns you can do it all the same as you can see before after and if you want to save your preset your new preset you can do it all the same you can go for example first to the manage extra you can create a new category just like this close and if you want you can go to the settings save settings as preset just like this you put the name you select a category just there and click on save and if you go back, just there, you will find your new preset just here with the new ability of the AI 
mask of course thanks for watching see you in the next video bye bye